Wow, that was a pretty amazing story we just heard about the Israelites wandering through the desert. You know what? I think we should take a minute and kind of imagine what it was like. Okay, so everybody close your eyes. Are you closing your eyes? All right, close your eyes and imagine it's really hot. I mean like the hottest you've ever felt outside. Very, very hot. You're sweaty, you're oh, stinky, you're walking, you're walking, you just keep walking and you are hungry. So hungry, like we've gone from hungry to hangry, full on hangry. And all you can think about is how Bonnie in the last minute to win it game played that Oreo cookie challenge and you just want an Oreo cookie. Oh, oh, Oreo cookies flying from the sky. Oh. Mm, that's good. Okay, so I have my Oreo cookie now. Um, I don't know if I need this Oreo cookie really, so I'm just gonna throw it over there. All right, so if your eyes are so closed, you can go ahead and open your eyes. Now let's think about this for a second. I think the Israelites get a little bit of a bad rap and we think, how could they be complaining and how could they be so hangry? Well, they probably were pretty uncomfortable in the moment. They probably were hangry, not just hungry. But here's what we can learn from them, because it's always good to learn from what other people have gone through. We can learn how God was still with them. They may have felt hangry, they may not have quite known where they were going, but God was still with them. And so I think sometimes when we go through hard times or confusing times, or we're just not quite sure, we feel like we're wandering through our own desert, Sometimes we can forget that we serve a great, great God. And I feel like that's kind of what happened because if we think back just a little bit to the stories we learned just a few weeks ago, the same God is leading them. It's the same God who parted the Red Sea for them. It's the same God who delivered them from the slavery in Egypt. That same God is the one who they're trusting in the wilderness. And I feel like we can definitely, I don't feel like, I know we can definitely trust that great, great God. And so here's what we can learn. In our own moments, when we feel like, goodness, I'm not quite sure where I'm going. I feel like I'm wandering. Maybe it's a really tough moment and you're feeling sad or upset about something. Remember the great God that you serve. That same God who has done amazing things before is the same God you serve right now. And he's a God who provides. Now, sometimes when he provides, it may not look like what we wanted, and it may not look like what we thought it should look like, but our God knows, and that's what we can trust, is we serve a God who knows. He knows what's best. And so we can rest in the fact that we serve a great and mighty God. And instead of complaining, and instead of worrying, and instead of wanting to go back to that place that wasn't good for us, I think we should worship our God, which is what we're learning about. Worship Him when it's hard, because He is a great and wonderful God, and He loves and cares for you. Here you go eat that Oreo cookie.